Okay, welcome to the last part of my pickups for over the past couple of months. Really since October, I would say. Round out this video here. Um, here's the last of the gaming stuff. This is a limited edition now. It's hard. To, it's getting harder to find. But the NES themed edition of the Nintendo 3DS. This is unopened. I haven't opened it. It should still be sealed and unused. Uh, but it looks like that. It looks really, really cool. It is heavy. Uh, but most sellers are going to charge you uh, a little bit more money for this edition just because it's limited. I had to have it because I'm original Nintendo fan um, and have been since 1990 so well worth owning if you're a 3DS fan there's many different iterations of 3DS out there uh, choose your favorite one and collect it or collect them all uh, you must have a big bank account if you're, <laughs> if you're doing that but um yeah here is the <clears throat> Sony Walkman, uh, ESP Max CD Walkman, part number D E three five zero. If that's the catalog number, here it plays CDR, CDWs, or I'm sorry, CDRWs and regular CDs. Uh, very cool. Didn't own one back in the day, so I'd have it. Actually, had to replace my other uh, portable CD player, and found that I could get two. For the price of a brand new one so I went ahead and did that and my old blue one looked just like this white one had the same case and everything uh, just different colors but uh, this is the uh, this phone plays CDRs and CD CDRWs as well has G production the other one has skip production as well I think that's DSP max I think that's what that is this is not none of these I don't think either of these players have that A-Track feature on it. I don't know what that is exactly. This has a hold button, and the battery compartment is on the inside with this one. The other one is on the outside and on the back. Uh, closes kind of weakly, so the spring might be loose. And I think it may have been dropped because there's a small opening right here. It's hard to camera to pick it up. I don't think my old one had that, but uh, still works and sounds pretty good. Uh, and I do have the original uh, charger for this if I need to just use it off of uh, electricity. This one's a little heavier. Um, I like the fact that the battery compartment is on the outside and it's easier to access, access that. But uh, yeah, you can actually, there's also a looper here where you can put some string or nylon through here and tie it to your, to your pants or something. This one the uh, I'll give you the catalog number too. The DEJ001 does not have all the features that uh, that the other one has, but it's good enough. You know, you have your play feature, stop, forward, backwards, uh, sound, P mode, volume up and down. The button layout's a little bit different than this one, but they both run off this probably the same or similar LCD type technology um, there's actually a menu button on here but I like the, the layout of the buttons on this better rather than the cramped ones on the other one other CD player <sighs> it doesn't really pertain to gaming but I guess I'll I guess I'll show it anyways actually I'll show this here's the packaging for Amazon's basics High speed HDMI cables. This is these 6.5 feet editions. They come in uh, like blue and green. They're color coded. I think maybe these could be the what red and yellow, maybe if they have those. I don't know if, how many colors they have, but uh, they work great and you can get two of them for like $20. So much better pricing than the big box stores have. And it comes with frustration free packaging so and I, I've been using them for a while and they work just as good as like 
like um, this, uh, Philips brand or another big brand. You don't have to pay big bucks for extra mic cables. Just know that, guys. Here's some. I have three of these. They're made in China. HDX box cutters. Three of them. And the blade locks at three different points. So that's cool. Bought them for home use and for use at work. This is all plastic on the outside. It's not metal. So that makes it more lightweight. You can put a piece of string through this loop here. This hole here. Tie them to your pants or whatever you're wearing. Screw here for easy access. You can take this out, unscrew this, and put a new blade in. This is a rubber grips on the sides. Seems like it's well, pretty well constructed. And you're not going to pay an arm and a leg for this. Just know that. So that, uh, yeah, that does it, guys. Look forward to another pickups video in two, anywhere from two to six months from now. Thanks for watching. If you want to go make a comment, go ahead and make it down in the comment section down below. And I'll get back to comments and questions as soon as I possibly can. And hit that subscribe button if you like this video or like what I have to offer.